If you love garlic, you will be enchanted with this garlic confit. To make garlic confit, we take raw garlic cloves and slowly poach them in olive oil until the cloves become utterly soft and taste mellow, almost sweet. It's like nothing you've ever tasted. It's absolutely addictive. The confit can be used to flavor all kinds of dishes, sandwiches, soups, pastas, pizzas, dips, and even mashed potatoes. Or you can make a fabulous garlic confit spread. For ideas and recipes, go to my website, foodandstyle.com. There is one crucial thing about making garlic confit. It needs to cook at a very low temperature. And I'll show you how we're going to achieve that. But first, let's peel our cloves. You'll need 10 ounces of unpeeled garlic cloves. That's about two cups. To peel this much garlic, there's a quick and easy technique. You'll need a large stainless steel bowl. Place half the garlic cloves in the bowl. Top with another bowl upside down. Hold tight and shake vigorously for about 10 to 15 seconds. Let's have a look. You see, the garlic cloves are totally peeled. Now remove the cloves that are skinless and continue shaking until all the cloves are done. Here we go. And now you repeat with the balance of the cloves. Now that the cloves are peeled, you want to trim the tough root ends. You'll need two essential tools for this recipe. First, a small one-quart saucepan. It will make it easier to measure the temperature of the confit and also use a lot less oil. And then a heat diffuser. If you have a professional stove, like a Viking or wolf, this tool is crucial. Place the garlic cloves in the pan and then add the olive oil. Place the heat diffuser on top of your burner and then place the pan on top of the diffuser. And as you see, the pan is not in direct contact with the diffuser. This is going to help us keep a very low heat. Place a thermometer in the pan and turn the heat on medium. Okay, we've reached the ideal temperature for cooking the confit. So now lower the heat and slow simmer for about an hour keeping the temperature between 200 and 210 degrees Fahrenheit. As you see, small bubbles are rising to the surface and that's okay, but make sure the oil never comes to a boil. It's been an hour and the confit is done. Look at the cloves. They have a lovely pale golden color and they are utterly soft, as soft as butter. So now turn off the heat. Remove from the stove and let cool to room temperature. You won't believe how good this garlic confit smells. Gives me hunger pangs every time I make it. Enjoy.